Peplink's new Speed Fusion Cloud makes bonding multiple connections together easier than ever. Hi, I'm Chris with the Mobile Internet Resource Center here to give you an update on Peplink and Pepwave routers. I like these were piled around me here. Uh, Peplink has just released a new firmware version 8.1, which Normally, a new firmware version is not newsworthy in any fashion. It includes all the usual bug fixes and slight tweaks and improvements. And in the case of PepWave, a lot of features that are intended for IT departments and enterprise deployments. So firmware updates aren't usually very interesting, but this one brings out one interesting new feature called a Speed Fusion Cloud. So PepLink's Speed Fusion technology is what they use for bonding multiple connections together. It's you know, take your uh, um, two cellular connections, maybe something tethered via USB and something in coming in over Ethernet, and actually using them all at once by this bonding technology, which creates a VPN over each of those connections, and then a bonding server somewhere on the Internet takes those separate connections, combines them back together, and you're out on the Internet combining the speed and, most importantly, the reliability of all the different connections you're going over. So speed fusion is pretty cool stuff. But in the past, Speed Fusion has required a little bit of complicated setup. You have to have either your own Speed Fusion server someplace in an enterprise data center, which most uh, nomads will not have. Uh, you need to pay for an expensive enterprise grade service, which is not really practical. Or you have to be geeky enough to set up your own virtual cloud server running Pepwave's free Speed Fusion solo software. All kind of tricky humps for somebody, even if you have a compatible router, getting your own Speed Fusion server is tough. But now in firmware 8.1, uh, Pepwave has made what they call unbreakable connectivity with a single click with Speed Fusion Cloud. And it's not quite a single click, but it is a lot easier to set up because now Pepwave is offering their own cloud Speed Fusion service. So you'll be able to go into the Pepwave dashboard once you upgrade to 8.1, the Pepwave Peplink dashboard, and just you'll see a new Speed Fusion Cloud tab right at the top, click that, register your device, and then basically just turn on the speed fusion bonding when you need it. Um, so great, simple, easy. Is this free? Well, no, it's, it is a, a paid service from Peplink. So they're giving you 90 days free or 100 gigabytes, or then you could buy additional terabytes of bonded usage for uh, $40 a terabyte, and there's some discounts for buying more. Um, so it's still easy to do and um, a kind of a new innovation on the Pepway front. Now, an important thing to know is that even though firmware 8.1 and Speed Fusion Cloud is going to basically all Pepway routers from the lowest end to the highest end, um, to really take advantage of it, you need one that actually supports using multiple connections at one time. So a lot of their lower end routers have multiple connections, but only one is active at a time. So the Speed Fusion Cloud feature will basically be just acting as a reliable VPN. But if you've got a device like the Max Transit Duo with two cellular modems in it, You'll be able to combine those two cellular modems plus two Wi-Fi as WAN connections plus Ethernet in, so you can have five connections bonded here. Or if you've got something like the Balance 20X, it's got its built-in cellular modems and plus a secondary cellular modem in the expansion slot plus a Ethernet, tether, uh, Ethernet and then USB tethering, so you'll have four connections you could bond potentially with something like this. Um, pretty easy, pretty fun, kind of fun, geeky stuff. This is, of course, not for everyone. These are high-end features. They're only appropriate some of the time. So to really understand the benefits, the trade-offs, the, the, the when and when not bonding actually makes sense. We have a full guide that goes a lot deeper into this um, at mobileinternetinfo.com slash bonding. So check that out. But if you do have a Pepwave router and you want to play with this, want to play with Speed Fusion Bonding, it's now easier than ever. And you can get started experimenting for free just to check it out. So Speed Fusion Cloud, it is out now. These videos are brought to you by our premium members, our mobile internet aficionados. They make it possible for us to track this news and create these videos. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment, subscribe to our channel, or better yet, consider becoming a member yourself.